Before I even talk about this crazy photo, I wanted to shout out Columbus Short because I made a silly video about him being on the run in Barbados and he actually talked to me back on Twitter. I think he favorited and retweeted the tweet about the original video that I talked about him being on the run in. Now, I posted this to my blog already back in, I guess it was July 30th of 2014 or something like that. I know it's getting close to, the, well, it's we're in the second week of August right now. It's August 8th of 2014 as I'm recording this, and I meant to put this video up, but I know better late than never. So former Scandal star Columbus Short tweeted out a photo of himself in what appears to be an airplane wearing headphones and drinking orange juice. No telling what's in the orange juice. Probably vodka. I'm just saying, not saying that it is in there for sure, just saying that, you know, he's probably having himself a little refreshment or whatever. Anyway, the photo's caption is red eye traveling at eagle height. Hashtag Barbados, baby. Hashtag catch me if you can living. Now, the photo was posted on July 30th of 2014 to his Twitter account. It's an obvious attempt at mocking the United States authorities, seeing that he fled the country, <laughs> as I previously reported. And he's living in Barbados now. So you can check out the link to that video and that blog at the meatmagazine.blogspot.com website. Now, Leonardo DiCaprio made a movie titled Catch Me If You Can, where he was on the run from authorities. And... <laughs> Columbus Short may think that this is funny to say stuff like that, but I hope that he gets away. That's all I'm going to say. You know them folks are not playing and you know that they're watching. And man, this dude is, he definitely, he's definitely very bold for, for all of this. It's, it's, this is so entertaining. But anyway, let me know what you think about the photo and this, this craziness below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channel. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com. Man, I wish I could get an interview on my radio show with him. Wish he would call in. Now I'm kicking myself for not asking. The only thing he could have said was no or yes, and I didn't even ask. Dang.